Well, while we wait for our green lights tonight, let's do a short video on installing air cleaner LEDs. I've already looked up in here and the way these come off is you push them down, you're gonna push them down all the way around and then rotate them. There's like a little path it can follow and then it has a bigger opening where it'll come out. So let's push them down and rotate them and hopefully they have enough clearance to get past this because I don't know how we're gonna get them out without unless we have to drop the whole can. We'll see. Okay, so you can get it off. Just gotta slide it out this way and you can kind of see. These little guys right here, they have spring loaded. And then they'll go on a track about that far and then they'll pop out. Took me a second of like pushing it back and forth, but then it popped loose. And now you have access to the inside of the air cleaner. With these LEDs attached up here to the top. So let's see, we have to clean out surfaces and brake cleaner and then get them sticky. So we are going with the trucks, 15 inch. $55 a piece. You can probably get them for cheaper, but that's what we're getting. And they're red because they have amber ore. I've already cleaned this one. I got to clean this one. And then uh, they just stick on with a 3M tape on the back of each one of them. So I'm going to take one of these out first and test it on these two wires back here. They just went straight. Two wires that go into tiny gauge wires that go to these bigger gauge wires. So it's got to just be a positive in the ground. So we'll test it first, make sure it works and what they're hooked up to, and then we'll get them all sticky. Okay, so make sure you get that surface pretty dang clean, as clean as you can, shining. Pull off that 3M tape, all those little things right there, and then stick it down there. I did the wires facing straight towards that because that is one of them that ends up on the side over there closest to the wires. So I'll probably be cutting that off because I don't need that much excess, but I wanted to be able to run it through, but I want it tight and I'll zip tie it so it doesn't hang. You know, you don't want to see the wires, so. Nice and clean, take the 3M off, put it right in the middle, and then we're gonna put this back on, but we have to thread that through the side first. So we capped them off up top, tied them up with some of the uh, awesome sticky tape. It's like the uh, canvas kind, guys. I don't know exactly who makes it, but it is awesome. Get some of that stuff automotive tape but it's it's not the sticky stuff it's um canvasy and that's what we look like no chicken lights uh yeah if you want to watch a live feed about all that going on check that out but we will do it with chicken lights with the switch that we found switch on okay i like it all right the obsession begins guys we'll do the other side but I like it. I'm glad we did red because it faces forward to this light, which is also red that faces back. So pretty cool. Okay. That is a how to on air cleaner lights, guys. $55 a piece. I'm sure you can get them cheaper somewhere else, uh, but I got them from the Chrome shop and I'm digging with a look. Just got to find that switch. Don't look through the whole fuse box like I did I'm trying to find if there's a blown fuse. And by the way, there was no blown fuses. <laughs> All right, guys. God bless you. Hope that helps somebody out.